Hello everyone, so I haven't actually started this vlog yet, I'm actually now home from the day but I never started it this morning because I'm always running late because that's just the type of person that I am so I thought I would start it now um, so basically today I went to London, I went to meet Collection, like Collection Makeup um, one of the girls from them called Natalia and we met up in Selfridges and yeah it was a really really fun day so my advent calendars have had a bit of a change of scene um, but yeah it's a bit of a mess, as you can see. The past few things I've got in my body shop one, well, today I got this um, oil of life. Like, it's like a full size, I think. Um, like, face oil, which is great, because I really love skincare stuff. And then the other day I got this um, British Rose exfoliating body gel, I think. Yeah, exfoliate, exfoliating gel body scrub. Um, so that just looks like this, which is really cool. I've already shown you guys this, and I think I've already shown you guys these ones before. Wait, what's this one? This is the Spiced um, Apple Body Gel Lotion. And then I also got an eye makeup remover, which is really, really handy for travel size, because it's like quite small, so yeah. Then the other day in my Johnny Loves Rosie calendar, I got these gold hoop earrings. And today I got this cute little silver necklace, which is really cute. It's got a little snowflake on it. Oh, and just in case you're wondering, uh, on my lips, I have ColourPop. 0, which is like one of the, um, what are they called? It's not the ultra matte ones, it's, oh, satin lip cream, I think. No, I'm just not 100% sure. But yeah, it's a really, really nice colour. And here is the rest of the footage. Giant Joe Malone bottles. Ooh. I like this one. Oh my god, it's all makeup. Looking. Oh, I have that panda thing. Oh, I have that panda stick thing. I was using it yesterday. What's it? Wasn't the big panda? Oh my god, this is literally like heaven. <laughs> You can't see all inside it because of the glare of the window, but they've got all of the like beauty advent calendars yeah. in there. And they've got the Mac Nutcracker collection up there. They've got nails. They've got nails ink. NYX. Oh, it's so pretty. I like Santa's holographic sequin suit. <laughs> just covered them right at the end. So I've just got back from a really long day in London. Actually it wasn't that long. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about but I had to get up quite early. Uh, we left here about 9.30 which for the Christmas holidays is quite early for me. But yeah basically the point of today is I was meeting with Collection Cosmetics or Collection Makeup whatever they are called. Collection. 
let's just leave it at that. And basically they invited me to Selfridges to meet up for coffee and um, to talk about some of their new products and they also very kindly gifted me a pair of shoes uh, just to say thank you for like supporting their brand this year which is amazing and if anyone from collection is watching this I just want to say a massive massive thank you to them because it was obviously super super generous and super kind of them and I am really excited, it's like a Christmas present, so thank you so much. So the shoes I picked out, I'm sorry if the lighting's a bit dodgy, are these um, Kurt Geiger Carvella boots. I was after a pair of black leather boots, just like some flat ones because I don't have any. My black boots are from New Look, like my flat boots are from New Look. And um, I just wanted some leather ones that were going to like last and be good quality and just be comfortable. I just wanted some like comfortable boots to kind of walk around uh in i don't know just out and about um so yeah i got these ones from carvella and they're really really nice they're really like nice leather and they're just pretty much like classic chelsea boots with like a gold but buckle and then like some details here so yeah i was super super happy with these so thank you so much collection for gifting these to me for christmas I love them so much. So they also gave me a few goodies in this little bag of makeup. I haven't actually looked through all of this yet, so let's get it out and have a look. Wow, okay, so that was more than I was thinking it would be. So I'm immediately drawn to this and this. This is the eyebrow kit, which looks really good. I don't have this and I've never tried this obviously because I don't have it. What am I talking about? I'm excited to use that one. Um, there's another one of the Eyes Uncovered palettes. I'm actually wearing the nude bronze one today. They are absolutely amazing and they're like $3.99. And then it seems like there's eyeliners, lip liners. Oh, there's a primer in here. I haven't tried this before. <gasps> the highlighting stick. Yes. There is, oh, yes, concealer. I've run out of my concealer and she's put one in here. Thank you so much. Um, and then some of the glitter eyeliners. There was a really cool colour that I spotted earlier, this one. This one is such a pretty colour. This one is in the shade Hustle, and it's kind of like, I don't know, it looks kind of holographic. So yeah, amazing. Thank you so, so much, guys. I then got two bits from MAC, because I could not resist. So I had a little bit of money left over, so I decided to go to MAC, and I got the Mineralized Skin Finish in Light Scapade, which was on my Christmas list, and... Um, I asked my mum who came with me to London, uh, like if she'd got anything for me from Mac for Christmas and she said no, so I thought I would go ahead and get this. So this is just like, it looks like a planet, it's so cool. It's got a load of colours, but then when you actually swatch it, it pretty much just comes out like a kind of whitish, pinkish colour. It's a really pretty highlight. I haven't tried it on my face yet, but like... The swatches I've done are so pretty. Let me just swatch it for you guys. I don't know if you can see that there on my hand. My lighting is really bad right now. There we go. Do you see that? It's so beautiful. And then finally, I got a lipstick in the shade Really Me. And I've wanted this for ages. So I'm really happy that I got it. So this is what Really Me looks like. It's a matte one. I'm pretty sure this is one of their new ones. And it's so pretty. It's kind of like a mauve greyish toned nude. And I'm so excited to put this on my face. Oh, and I'm really sorry about my plasters. I have obviously been in London. I get really, really nervous when I go to London. So I have been chewing my fingers all day. I know you guys didn't need to know that, but there you go. So overall, I did have a really, really lovely day. Despite the fact that going to London stresses me so, so much. I put on Twitter the other, other day, I don't know. Whoops. Oh, thank God it didn't break. I put on Twitter the other day, like, I don't know if anyone has any advice for like traveling alone if you have anxiety because I personally have never been on a train by myself. I know it sounds crazy because I'm 19 but yeah, my anxiety has stopped me so far and I've never been to London by myself. Like today my mum came with me and I really wanna try and like get out to meetings that people are trying to arrange with me and stuff. Um, but when it's like during the week, obviously my parents work so I don't have anyone to go with and today it just happened that my mum was free to come with me and yeah I don't really know what to do so if anyone has any advice about traveling alone and stuff and how to start traveling alone then just let me know and it's not the actual like traveling that I'm scared of like getting my ticket and you know like 
train times and all of that stuff, that doesn't make me nervous at all. It's the fact that I have to go on a train by myself and I'm scared that something bad is gonna happen on the train. I'm scared that it's gonna like crash or there's gonna be like a terrorist attack or that I'll get kidnapped or like somebody will murder me, I don't know. I'm just more scared about like going places by myself because I'm scared that I'm gonna get attacked or like kidnapped or something. So if anyone has any experiences with like traveling alone with anxiety of like being by themselves, then just let me know, that would be great. But anyway. Let's just not talk about that. Um, I've had a really, really good take today. I'm now actually going to see two of my best friends and we're gonna get Chinese takeaway, which is amazing. And then I'm probably just gonna come home, edit some videos and go to sleep because it's been a long day. So thank you so much again to Collection for this day. It's been really, really fun. And yeah, that is pretty much it. I will see you guys in my next vlog. Bye.